Welcome to Keyside Education Portal. Today, we will be discussing the pull-up pull-down resistor test for Keyside X1149. We will start by doing an overview of the pull-up pull-down test. During the pull-up test, U5 pin 2 is being pulled up to 5 volt via R16 resistor. This test will check for the right state of resistor and make sure that there are no bridging faults such as shorts or solder shorts. Given the resistance value, the test checks whether the pull-up resistor is working. In the case of the pull-down test, we have U5 pin 2 being pulled down to ground via the R22 resistor. By checking if pin 1 reflects a low, this test will check whether the pull-down resistor is working correctly. Now, we will proceed to the pull-up pull-down software guide. We will start by generating pull-up pull-down test by going to process outline. Generation and finally, tests. After ensuring the generate box for pull up and pull down test is checked, click on generate slash compile to generate the resistor pull up pull down test. Next, we will proceed to run the test. In the case when we encounter a failed test result, we will refer to the repair ticket to resolve the issue. In this case, we will refer to the repair ticket, and as reflected here, the possible fault is identified to be at node N17298882. We may also choose to look at the waveform viewer to debug the errors faced in the resistor pull-up slash pull-down test. Alternatively, we can also refer to the node list to debug the failure. After debugging, run the test again. When the test result indicates a pass, it means that the resistor pull-up slash pull-down test is successful.